this is our latest latest project this is a uh, Philips valve radio uh, and uh, it says Novosonic I will show you the model number uh, it is written at the back here it is B4CA98U uh, you can see it's in very uh, bad condition the grill cloth is uh, damaged here and uh, and it is all covered in dirt just have a look Yeah, that's the view of the inside of this radio and you can see it's all covered in dirt. As you can see, uh, there are dropper registers and no transformer. So this is an AC-DC set. And uh, there are no valves in it because uh, I have removed the valves and I have tested them. They are all okay. I have removed the valves because uh, while transportation, uh, just for safety, because they may get damaged while transportation. The loudspeaker seems to be in a good condition, though I can see some uh, cracks on the diaphragm, so we can repair that, but otherwise the loudspeaker is okay. That's the ferrite rod antenna for medium wave and that's the magic eye. These are the IFTs, intermediate frequency transformer and you can see the amount of dirt in it. We will give it a good cleaning and then we will continue with the restoration project. This is the volume control and this is the tuning. The There is no tone control uh, knob in it but there are tone control switches, push button switches. These are tone control. Uh, I exact, right now I exactly don't know what is the function of all these. Uh, I have to check out the service book for uh, but uh, but here it's written mellow speech treble one treble two treble three and these are the uh, medium wave short wave three short wave two and short wave one and these are, these are the piano keys for selecting the bands and it says novosonic so this is in philips novosonic radio also you can see that the short wave one is brand spread This radio is probably from 1964 and uh, as far as the age goes uh, this is very old and uh, for a radio of its age this is fairly good condition because uh, these uh, if we remove all the dirt and grime then the, the radio is in good condition because the cabinet is all okay there is no uh, crack in it uh, the, the grill cloth that can be repaired. So next we'll give it a good cleaning and we take out we will take out the chases and we clean it. Also we will clean the cabinet and uh, then we will proceed with the restoration project of the electronic part of this radio. And this is the end of this first part and thank you for watching and stay tuned for the next part.